Hello everybody, and welcome back to a new game called Salt. Uh, I know nothing about it, I've just picked it up off Steam. Uh, as you all already know, I'm very into my survival crafting heavy games, so I thought uh, I'll give Salt a go, because uh, I, it is newish, it is a newer game, I believe. Um, but yeah, let's just get in and have a look and see what it's all about. Also, Pirates! Pirates are my favourite thing in the world. I consider myself a modern day pirate. And uh, they're fantastic. Also, I like this. Attention to detail. You move, the background moves with you. That's really cool. New game. Uh, name, Deck Climber. <laughs> well, we could easily just change that to Dick Climber. No, we can't do that name. Let's just go the old, uh, the old fly glint. <clears throat> we don't need the five in there. My name is Fly. Fly Glint, the pirate. Hardcore, one life. No. Normally I would because I'm a dick, but no. Nah, I'll go normal purely for the uh, purposes of a longevity. Uh, world Seed. Uh, oh, no. What have I done? Default. Okay. <clears throat> so you can pick up custom worlds, it seems like. Uh, I haven't even seen playthroughs of this. I actually have no idea. Do you want to play after... I beg your pardon. Oh my god, we're in Minecraft. Alright, so left and right mouse buttons do nothing. E does nothing. Okay. I actually didn't know it was going to be this cartoony. Um, to be completely honest. Now, it is a survival game, but I've seen... I saw one little trailer, and they were, like, interacting. Is that an egg? Or is that a fucking rock? Weak boulder. Well, I'd love to smash that weak boulder, but... Oh, good. Shift to run. Ah, stamina bar. Oh, God. So it's just press. It's not hold. That's kind of annoying, actually. You press it once to run, and then you press it again to turn it off. Eh, not for me. But anyway, I'm sure I shall adapt. Now, I'm just wandering around pressing E on things, and currently that's not working out too well for me. Uh, just exploring the coastline at the minute. M. Oh, oh, oh. What have I done? Oh, you got to map it yourself. Erase this island from the map. Oh, no. Okay, so I've put my island there. Now, what's this? Oh, I can zoom in. Oh, God. Oh, what? Okay, so you have to map it yourself. So, if that's my island... Then I can put other islands to the north and the south and the... Oh, my God. Okay, I get... Strange. Uh, not for me just yet. That's a bit too complex. How can I map an island when I've just appeared on it? Oh, okay. There's a log here. Can I do something with this log? Ah, oh, wood log collected. Oh, fantastic. Tab to open my inventory. Crafting journal. <coughs> General pickaxe campfire. Uh, one hand stone, one hard stone rather. A hand stone. What the fuck's a hand stone? One hard stone, one log. Campfire is three logs, two flint stones, two Barney rubbles. Uh, a basic potion, two flowers. I wish I could just mix flowers and make friggin' potions. Weapons, a club. So should I be getting a weapon straight up? Like, is that a smart thing to do? I'm not too sure. What's this tab? Okay, so... Club. Look at this. Look at this guy just doing stuff. How do I get it out now, though? Is that in my inventory now? It is. Uh, on the right hand. Oh, there he is. Block. Hit. Look at this. This guy. Pro Gamer. MLG. Uh, am I back at the... Oh, I'm going to smash this weak boulder. And it is not going to know what hit it. No, I should turn sprint off. There we go. Oh, yeah. Cop that. Now, you can't hold down. If you just hold down, he stops hitting, which I personally don't like. But that's okay. Oh, my God. What did I get? Uh, two flint stones and a stone brick. Let's go back to our urinal. It's a soft J. Hit it very soft. One hard stone? No, I've got a stone block. Okay. 
Okay. Maybe hardstone is meant to say stone block. Or maybe I can break that down in the crafting table or something. And two flint stones. Now, two flint stones and three logs means campfire. So I might give that a craxical. Interact. E. Oh, sorry. That was in... That's still in the thing. Ah, okay, okay. Now I'm just going to try something here. Oh my god. How do I... Jesus, you got to... I hate it when menus overlap. Oh, so this gives me... Right, so if you put components in, it comes up with suggested recipes anyway. That is a good mechanic. I'm digging that. Stone block. Now, I know this is probably tedious for a lot of you out there who have already played the game, but this is more of a first look for people who haven't played the game and they're not sure whether they want to buy it yet. Um, I may turn it into a series because I love pirates and if I really like the game, I'll keep it going. But, um, yeah, we'll, we'll see. If, if you do like my playthroughs, by the way, I know a lot of people don't like leaving comments because it's too convoluted or, or what have you, but um, just a simple thumbs up, just a quick like, and uh, that'll indicate to me if a video at our level gets sort of 10, 20 likes, then I know. Oh, save. There we go. Then I know to keep it going as a series and, and play more. So it's all about interactiveness. Don't be afraid to get in touch. So five stone, one wood is a sword. Stone mounting plate is just three straight up stone. Okay, so we'll pull that back out. Flintstone. Oh my god, we can make arrows. We can make everything. Campfire. I feel campfire is probably... The... A sextant? A sex tent? A tent for sex? Oh shit. This game just went full triple X style. Like, oh, I kind of feel uncomfortable with this now. Okay, anywho, enough sex tents. How do you build a sex tent? Can I club this? Nah, I'm going to need an axe for that. Alright, so first things first, we're going to have to find... Ah, more logs. Oh my god, get out of the tree, you sex tent. God damn it, so many sex tents. Okay. Um... Logs, logs, beautiful logs. The more you eat, the more you flog. There's just a pickaxe. Well, okay. That's kind of weird. Ah, hot bar. So do I actually have to equip it? There we go. And now I can fast switch. Like in Minecraft. Everything's like Minecraft. Uh, is that how you... Nah, that'd be too too obvious. Well, not too obvious. That'd be too silly, using a pickaxe on a thing. Can I mine sand? Nah. At least you can interact with the sand, and, like, it, it makes a, a, a noise. A lot of games don't even bother making a friggin' noise when you hit things, so you're just, like, hitting through it. So, attention to detail once again. Now, this isn't an alpha or a beta or anything. It is a fully-fledged, uh, released game already, which... Means you can just go buy it. I think it was 20 AUD, so 30 to 40 for you Americans out there and um, Brazilians. For some reason, we there's a fair few Brazilians that watch our videos. Go figure. There we go. Now we're cooking with the gas. Now, oops, sorry about that. Does that yield anything differently? No, it doesn't. Okay, but what I am going to do is... Did I get everything out of that? Yeah, I did. There's just still stone sitting there. Uh, I'm going to go to this crafting table. Sorry, I've got us all back. Oh, sorry, guys. Very unprofessional, but... Okay, so tripwire, crude arrows, a sail raft, just straight up rafting, a torch, uh, a pickaxe, which I have, so I don't need. Do I need... Do I just use the club on the trees? Is there no axe? The Red Maiden. Oh my god. So this game gets full on. It gets full on. Okay. Bamboo Matt. I'm guessing I've been stranded. I imagine my name's Captain Dick Sparrow. And um, some cunts left me on the island. Bow. Fiber. So I need fiber. I need all sorts. Wow. Campfire is really the way to go though. Wooden flint. I think that's what I need. 
Like, if the survival game uh, in me knows anything. Now, I'm going to go ahead and try and hit some plants or something. Hit some grass, get fiber. No. But I couldn't really make any other tools, so... It's all uh, still a little bit... I'm not sure if this is right. It doesn't seem right just blocking it because it doesn't have a health bar either. I don't know. I feel I should need an axe, but I've been wrong once or twice before. So we'll hit the. This one's green because it, oh, it's a rich boulder. Oh, give me cool. Oh my god, what was that? I heard stuff. Hard stone. Oh no, wait, that's hard stone ore. Oh, do I need a smelt shit? Oh, some topaz. It's a bit lovely. I like topaz in my life. Um, did I find a club? Or why is that there? Anyways. Oh my god, what's happened? I, did I click off it somehow? It seems not buggy, but just loose. Like all the menus and everything. Like it's not tight, the game. If that makes sense. Not very tight. It's a, uh, it's a, it's a bit of a, bit of a wizard sleeve. It's a bit of a whore's vagina. It's a bit, there's a raft right there. Whose raft is that? Whose raft? Oh, I've got to repair it. So rather than build the raft, I can just repair the raft. Okay, is this a rock too? No, that's just dirt sand. Sand dirt. Ah, oh, some lovely music. Fucking love music, mate. Nope, no music. Just, just some guy behind me with a piano. Dong, ding. I turn around, he fucking hides in a bush. Jesus Christ, where's my pianist? My pianist in my sex tent. This game has gone very overtly sexualized. Alright, we should be able to make a... Uh, that's pretty much what I was looking for. Just some ingredients to actually make. A campfire. There we go. Craft that shit. Oh, craft it hard. Oh, yeah. Now, we have a campfire. So, what am I going to do... Okay, campfire, campfire. Uh, yeah, okay, so that's in my inventory. So I'm assuming it's like any game. You put it in your inventory and then you go ahead and place it down somewhere. Where I should camp, I don't actually know. Maybe near the raft? Like, is that smart? I don't know, maybe here, out in the open. A little bit of tree cut. <gasps> is this an open world game? Like, is this stuff for me or is there someone else here? I'm freaking frightened. Oh my god, I'm getting my club out. Hey, bruh. Hmm. A mysterious figure. You're not awake, I see. Discuss. Discuss the fact I'm awake. Speak to stranger. I wondered how long you would lay there. I was starting to think you wouldn't make it. Why he sounds like an old wizard, I don't know, but he is now. Not many travel to my island these days, and rarely do I let myself be known to those that do. Luckily for you, unlucky for the pirate laying by my campfire. You need some supplies? I suppose you can take what is in my chest and crates, and whatever that pirate was carrying. So he's literally said, Take my shit! <laughs> okay. Ooh. Entry added. Okay. It is not what one says, but what one does that defines them. And so the question remains, who will you be? You might be able to make a name for yourself in this land. There is a man that keeps a number of inns throughout the seas, marked by beacons. Perhaps pay him a visit, if you need some direction. Okay. 
Can you tell me about sex tents? That raft over there? That is not mine. You can take it. It looks like it needs repair, though. So, this has been a very strange interaction. Essentially, what I got from this strange-looking Lego warrior here is... There's a dead man. Take his shit. Take my shit. He brought a raft. He's fucking dead, though. So take his fucking raft and fuck off to that island. The, he's weird. He's sitting weird. He's strange. He's got big hands, though. I don't know if I trust that. Oh, my God, yes. Fucking club. All right. I mean, a what's it called? A sword. Can I... Oh, i got to take it first. I can't... Oh, my God, all these things. Orders from Buffet. Oh, it's... Entry one. Bah! I seem to have left my pickaxe laying around this island somewhere. Well, that explains the random pickaxe. I'm glad we got an explanation. Somewhere. I've got no time to be looking for it, though. Being an initiate, Captain Buffbeard has sent me on a mission to pillage and plunder as much as I can in the next few days. He says if I gather enough gold and valuables, he will consider letting me join his crew. With his orders, I plan on visiting as many islands as I can, and killing anyone that gets in my way. Is it the pirate? It is the pirate's way, after all. The captain said that I was to look for him on an island, with wood stumps and orange-tinted grass, when I had enough goods. I will hurry and complete this mission. Buffbeard is not a patient man. Sincerely, Whitlow. Okay, so basically I'll keep that journal because I'm guessing that's loosely they've just told us here's a mission for the game. Travel around the islands, get golden treasure, go see Buffbeard and uh, we can join his crew to become a, a fully fledged pirate like Whitlow here. Well, he's not fully fledged yet. And the island will have uh, wood stumps and orange tinted grass. And that's how... It Ooh, that ash. <sighs> That booty. Uh, bronze chest key. Take you. And what are you? Ragged gloves. Okay, so we'll go ahead and we'll put the uh, the glovey gloves on. Where do they go? Oh! Oh, so is this... Do I have two inventories? That's my backpack and this is... Maybe. Can I... No, I see. Okay, I see, I see, I see. And I'll just hop bar this. Because... Right, 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 right. It's all making a bit more sense now. So this is literally a hot bar. You can probably put anything you want in there. Equipping things up there. Once I scroll to that, it will... It's like a fast equip. Okay, we get it now. We get it, we get it, we get it. Okay, so this game is actually looking very promising. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, end this first look, episode one here. But I'm actually going to keep playing, so I'll keep it recording. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. If you're enjoying Salt, please leave me a thumbs up, a little like, and uh, that'll encourage me to make more and more and more. If you're not already subscribed, do click the button over there. There's a little picture of both of us, myself and Becca. Uh, hit subscribe. Every subscribe and every like does count and shows a lot of support, so we do thank you very much. And uh, I'll catch all y'all in the next episode. But for now, see you later. Bye-bye.